Well, right here, this is the alternator, and that generates is what converts the engine's power into electricity. It's unusual to find 17-year-olds working in a high-tech manufacturing plant. All right, Tyler, this is the... Here in South Carolina, an influx of European companies has created a demand for skilled employees. But manufacturers say there's a critical shortage of trained workers in the United States. We worked over here over the summer, 40 hours a week, and we come here every Monday and Tuesday. When the manufacturer Tognum had trouble finding the workers it needed to make its MTU diesel engines, it decided to bring a German-style apprenticeship program to Icon County, South Carolina. But it's something that a lot of people at the school kind of idolize us for, you know? I mean, they know us as the, those guys that go work at that plant. And uh, yeah, it's pretty cool. Nationwide, the unemployment rate for workers with just a high school diploma is nearly twice that for college graduates. In this part of South Carolina, jobs are scarce and wages lower than the national average. If you actually look at this valve, you got What I'm going to be doing for the next two years is going to be training me. And even if I don't want to stay at MTU, I'll still have two years of training that I can fall back on if I want to do, do that, or if I want to do something else, I'll still have that two years of experience. To let it exhaust from a different port and power to different port. Jordan Dunbar is among the handful of students in the apprenticeship program. Two years ago, Tognum's executives partnered with the Icon County Career and Technology Center to develop a shared curriculum. They began with six juniors and added six more this year. I thought this may be a good experience, but at the same time, I'm not, not sure. And the more I learned about the entire thing, the more I realized this is an amazing opportunity and I can't just pass it up. In Germany, blue-collar jobs are prized. The education system there offers apprenticeship programs that prepare students for manufacturing careers. The apprenticeship program is pretty much, um, you can't guarantee anything, but the closest to guaranteeing a, a job after graduation as possible. If you look at it, the success rate that they're having in Germany, why can't we have it here? I mean, basically it's the same thing. The apprentices here will graduate with a high school diploma, a certificate in industrial maintenance, and a chance for a job at Togdom, or even to have the company help pay for college. For now, they spend about seven hours a week as paid workers at the plant, while splitting class time between high school and the vocational center. I hope more companies um, get on board with the apprenticeship. My goal would be to have, you know, almost every student in here in some type of apprenticeship program. It's a good experience, like, for being a high school student and, like, knowing there's only six people that got to make it and I got to make it. It's, it's a good feeling. I feel like I accomplished something.